influenza infections because of the natural occurrence in our community and because of vaccination we do have some natural and vaccine acquired immunity so it is very unlikely to cause a pandemic like covid-19 because that was a totally new virus and we didn't have any immunity against that still because the virus has a tendency to change its shape and structure we have to be careful in most of the cases h3n2 is a self limiting upper respiratory tract infection that means if you take adequate rest warm fluids along with some paracetamol and anti allergic medication you'll be all right only in some cases like extremes of age or comorbidities patient may experience breathing difficulty fall in oxygen saturation or the child may become dull and listless and not accepting feed in these cases the person should be admitted to the hospital at the earliest and may require some specific antiviral medications also as the name suggest it is caused by a virus so and antibiotics are against bacteria because the infection is not caused by a bacteria antibiotics are useless sometimes this can be even harmful for your system because it will cause resistance to develop and whenever you would need antibiotic it wouldn't work so for an treatment of any viral infection including h3n2 please do not take antibiotic it will cause more harm than any benefit for respiratory infections including influenza uh, infections following precautions would be helpful so maintaining a distance social distance whenever possible if you step out in a crowded area wear your mask it is it will not save you only from covid but also from all respiratory infections vaccination is important